Hey everybody, Bill Sack here, your favorite attorney with the Firearms Policy Coalition legal team. Last week, your FPC legal team fired up the trusty lawsuit printer and filed yet another federal Second Amendment lawsuit. This one challenging New York City's ban on electronic arms like stun guns and tasers. The lawsuit seeks a judgment declaring the city's ban on these arms is unconstitutional and seeks preliminary and permanent injunction against enforcement of the law, as well as attorney's fees and costs. The complaint makes clear, stun guns and tasers are bearable arms that are in common use for self-defense. As such, they are protected by the Second Amendment. In fact, the superintendent of the New York State Police has stipulated in prior litigation that hundreds of thousands of tasers and millions of stun guns are owned by private citizens all over the country. The complaint details that despite multiple courts finding that similar laws are unconstitutional, the city of New York continues to enforce state and local bans on stun guns and tasers, trains its officers that the devices are illegal, and continues to arrest individuals found to be in possession of them. FPC's own intrepid and effervescent senior director of legal operations, Adam Kraut, had this to say, and I quote, As many courts have properly held, electronic arms are commonly kept and carried for self-defense. Under the Supreme Court's precedence, New York City's ban on these common arms is categorically unconstitutional. The city may not like the Second Amendment, but it cannot opt out of the Constitution, unquote. As always, you can read more about this case, as well as all of the other cases your FPC legal team is involved in, at fpclegal.org. I'm Bill Sack, your favorite attorney with the Firearms Policy Coalition legal team.